hi everyone welcome back to my channel my name is Ayomi and I'm going to be making easy made fish I mean like not necessarily using much oil and also cooking my fish well prepared and not using much oil to ensure that I mean I have zero tolerance for using much oil in my food anyway so I'm going to be showing you guys what I do and when I'm in a rush I'm gonna need to cook my fish very fast today I'm going to be using croaker fish and also partly using tilapia fish to make fish soup. I'm going to be making fish soup in a different pot and also frying my fish with very little or no oil at all in another, another pot. Let's get started guys. So I'm, I already washed my fish and cleaned it and I'm just going to spice it up and put it in my pot and start um, frying with little or no oil at all. Come with me. So guys, I have my fish here. Um, this is croaker fish. I already salted it. I'm just adding a little bit of spice. I'm just going to marinate into it right now. So it will be frozen, but that's okay. It needs to be working with you like that anyway. So. so this way, I get to like cook my fish without using, I'm going to be showing you guys, there's no oil in my pot yet. So I'm literally not using any oil. And at some point, I'll just put a little oil because of the I'm going to be adding. I'm going to be adding um, boiled um, pepper mix that I already had in my fridge already so that you guys can see easy made fish I mean this is really good for maybe like elderly people and for someone like me if you are still young and you don't really like much oil in your food usually fried foods and I don't have absolute tolerance for fried food I don't, really, I don't really like fried food like that but then you know, it's yummy when you eat it so I like to cook my food with little oil in food so guys, let's get started. This is my fish already marinated, right here, and I'm going to be putting it in the pot. So this is my pot. There's little or no oil in it, as you can see. So no oil at all. Just fry like that. I'm going to put it in like this. I'm going to be cooking this on medium heat so that I don't burn my pot and also burn my fish. So I'm going to be transferring my fish into my pot. into my pot. You can see there's still no oil in it. And my stove is on. I'm going to allow this to stick a little bit. It's cooking. Next thing is my tilapia fish, like I mentioned. This is croaker fish. I'm going to be kind of oil frying, or let me say pot frying, not, not oil at all, but then I'm going to be frying it. I'll show you guys. And I'm going to be making my tilapia fish in a form of soup form. I'm not going to be frying it, I'm going to be boiling it and also adding like a lot of spice and pepper in it. Kind of in that soup. That light soup. Like, so let me get my. So guys, we're gonna allow this to steam a little bit before I add my little bit of oil and also my pepper mix. Um, that I already bought, like the dry cooked pepper mix for it to cook and I'll allow the pepper to soak it. So guys, I'm going to be adding very little oil that I saved in here into my um 
broker fish because they are already being in port for like maybe a couple of minutes now. We need to be adding it for it to, you know, give it that brownish um, color at the back fried so that I can feel like I'm eating fried food. But I'm not just really fried food because I didn't use much oil. I'm using very little oil, literally drops. So I'm going to be adding it. That's gonna be it. And my fish is good to go. Guys, I think we are ready to go. I can I can feel it. I can smell it. I think we are good to go. I'm gonna be opening this up um, to ensure that the fish is having that brownish um, fry line. Whoa. Yes, guys, the fish is done cooking the dry meat unless I want it to cook more. But then I think I'm good with this. I'm going to be showing you guys. This actually cooked perfectly well with, like I said, very, like, I actually had drops of oil in it. If, if, if you saw me pointing, like, drops of oil, if I eat, no, I would say no oil at all. But then I had drops of oil in it. And I still got that fried, like, um, skin at the back for me to um, enjoy it. So guys, I think for now we are done cooking for today. My rice is ready. My tilapia fish is pan fried and my soup is done. And now I can enjoy it. I achieved my results right here without um, adding much oil at all, like literally drops of oil for me to achieve this um, fry like form of tilapia fish. And my soup is uh, thick to a very um, reasonable extent for me to have a soup like for not enjoying having stew. So guys, please subscribe to my channel if you haven't subscribed and click on the like button if you're watching this video. Share my video as well and let me know if you want to cook any particular food. Anything you want, anything you want to see on my channel, please let me know in the comment section. Thank you and...